Hi, this is Rajiv Rawal. I'm the uh, Global Director of Software Life Science Mass Spec, Thermo Fisher Scientific. Um, so we have a lot of excitement for, uh, in a lot of areas. Uh, we're producing new software for our metabolomics uh, market space, uh, Compound Discover 2.0, in which uh, we can now ID do un untargeted discovery. Uh, we have uh, on the biopharma market, we have a new characterization piece of software, which we're very excited about. Uh, and, uh, and then, as you can see on this area, that we have our cloud-based applications uh, so we have a couple of areas that we're uh, uh, really concentrating on. One is uh, on, on, on our project to how to take our multi-omics data and actually uh, create biological information out of that. And then the other side is actually we have uh, software to now monitor your instruments. Literally you can do that in an iPad or an iPhone. Um, and uh, you can, or you could see it without remotely wherever you are. Uh, how your instruments are performing, what if they have any error statistics around that area, or um, uh, if if you want to be notified through email if there's you know on sequence completion, batch completion, those kind of things, and then we have an entire data processing workflow as well, uh, which we call our sample profiler. So this is uh, to really do more things like. Uh, what is normal in my sample. Uh, so it compares your data to see what are the emerging contaminants um, or you know or you could do QC diagnostics in that. Uh, how's your instrument performing if you want to shoot some standards and see how uh, how those standards are behaving uh, relative to the performance uh, that you would expect. Um, so we have the entire workflow where you can do and then you can do big data mining out of that and see out of all the normals that you have accumulated over time, uh, how, you know, whether, whether a sample is within range or not. And so this is, these are just some of the seeds that we are planting, but we're very, very excited about some of these softwares that we're going to be releasing very soon in the cloud area. Um,